Welcome to Paddling Adventures Radio. I'm Sean Rowley, and with me is Derek Specht. Hello. One of the other fellas that I've been, uh, just to switch subjects now, um, I've been trying to chat with him for a while now. Uh, it just doesn't seem to work out when I want to get a hold of him. Tim McDonough. He is with the Kirk Whipper Voyager Center up near, it's Connaught, just east of Timmins. Timmins. Yep, up by Timmins. Right. Um, he was at the Ontario Backcountry Canoe Symposium mm-hmm. in all his Voyager yes. outfit. and I've seen him before. Yeah. I'm sure I've seen he him. He looked before. familiar. Yeah. He must we he must have been in another event or something. We've I'm, been yeah, at. I'm thinking we've we've met him before, I just didn't realize who yeah. he was. There was a couple of people I've met that I've been wanting to talk to and I chatted with them and didn't realize just didn't include in who they were okay. this weekend. And I'm just like, Oh, I was talking to him. You gotta <laughs> be kidding me. So anyway, uh that was my you know <laughs> what are you gonna do? <laughs> So we've been trying to hook up, and we're, we, I want to get him on the show. I think I'm, we're going to end up doing a phone interview or something with Tim. 2018 True North Voyager Brigade, August 20th to 26th, 2018. Um, they're looking at, and see, I'm just looking at stuff. They've, they're looking at doing a five-year goal with these Voyager canoes. This year... 450 bucks for yeah. six days. Okay. It's realistically. It's not too bad. You get a long sleeve t-shirt, True North Voyager Brigade 2018 crest, campground, washroom, water, hydro for phone and camera, firewood, breakfast, supper each day, entertainment on two evenings, marketing and scouting, entry fee for sightseeing stuff, polar bear habitat, a pioneer village, wildlife wagon rides, five museums. That's a really good price. And transportation during the brigade and canoe rental. That's a good price. That's a good price. Not included lunch and beverages while canoeing daily. It's your crew's responsibility and alcoholic beverages. Yes, of course. That's a, that's, that's a going thing. 2018, they are doing the headwaters of James Bay. Five museums, polar bear habitat, which we've been at uh, in, in Cochrane. Uh, Heritage Village, meeting up with 1,500 trappers throughout the province of Ontario. Voyager Banquet at Cedar Meadows and the Great Canadian Kayak Challenge and Festival. Wow. And when, when is that this year? This year, August. In August. Yeah, the, the end of August, 20th to 26th. Hmm. Um, so that's just, they've got all these different things they're trying to do 2019, the Tomogamy region, 2020, the Tomiskaming region, 2021, the French River region, 2022, Trent Severn Waterway. And they're hoping to be at the new... Canoe Museum in Peterborough for 2022. Yeah. And all these brigades are to honor Kirk Whipper. Okay. Right? So that's cool. This year, and, the, and one of the things they're, they're talking about is never before, never again. 40th anniversary of the Kirk Whipper Voyager Center project. 50th anniversary of the Timmins Fur Council. 24th anniversary of the... OFMF, which is the Ontario Fur Managers Federation. Mm -hmm. 10th anniversary of the Kayak Challenge and Festival. 125th anniversary of Ontario Parks. Uh, That's this year. Yep. That's going to be a busy year. (laughs) <laughs> so they're they're doing all these things, and then you're you know now, promoting have, all of this. Do you have to dress up as a uh, voyageur? To I don't participate? think so, but that'd be kind of cool to do it. I want that sash and the hat. Yeah. Um, clothing program will allow every participant to look at like a member of the True Brigade. Oh, the clothes are based on voyageurs of the past. In three years, our brigade will be dressed from head to toe. So I guess they're building it up as, as you go. Yeah. But you can get one of the shirts in that, right? Yeah. So, yeah, that's that's pretty uh, pretty cool. What are you doing this August? We should go. Mm, <laughs> Tomogamy. <So. laughs> but the, he's, he gave me, he passed me off all yeah. this literature so that I can take a look at it and we'll, we'll uh, chat with him. Uh, but the schedule, yeah, August 20th, you do all your registration and your meetings and all that. August 21st, breakfast at Connaught City Hall, Matheson, Thelma Miles Historical Museum, canoe launch at Black River Boat Launch, lunch at the Cour de Bois Campground, 
uh, arrival at Iroquois Falls, a presentation, walk through the arena and an and Iroquois Falls Pioneer Museum, supper at the station, then return back to Kip Whipper, Kirk, Kirk Whipper Voyager Center. I'm trying to read this way too fast. <laughs> uh, then there's crew meetings and campfires. The next day, same same sort of thing, except you're launching on a different river. You're going somewhere else. Okay. It looks like each day you're paddling somewhere else and seeing different yeah. museums and stuff like that. But that goes on for, yeah, like the, what, the, the six days. That sounds and really that's cool. really cool. So I'm looking forward to talking to Tim. Um, yeah, Kirk Whipper Voyager Center, the True North Voyager Brigade. So that's this year out of uh, the Kirk Whipper uh, Voyager Center up way, way, way up near Timmins, Cochrane. Hmm. Just, yeah, just east of Timmins in Connaught. Um, yeah, looking forward to uh, chatting with uh, Tim about that. So we're going to hook up and do a little phone conversation. And yeah, yeah. Let him explain everything about it and why we should be doing this because you know it, it is cool especially if you can get in the big the big uh, voyager 50 foot voyager canoes and stuff like that well i don't know about the 50 feet are they not 50 feet no uh 30 feet yeah something 30. like that maybe it's 50 feet you don't know <laughs> you're not the boss of me no tight turns <laughs> <laughs> well, there's there's such popular thing to do. They just had to add an extra twenty feet, <laughs> fifty feet. Yeah, yeah. It's one of those big, rare fifty footers. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that's, why, that's how they used to carry the horses up there. You know, <laughs> they put the horses and the cows in there. Yes. <laughs> oh, geez. Uh, so yeah, we're looking forward to that one. Uh, what else do I got on our list here? It's an 